In geometry, the rhombic arboctahedron, or small rhombic arboctahedron, is an Archimedean solid with eight triangular and 18 square faces. There are 24 identical vertices, with one triangle and three squares meeting at each. The polyhedron has octahedral symmetry, like the Cuban octahedron. Its dual is called the deltoidal icosatetrahedron or trapezoidal icosatetrahedron, although its faces are not really true trapezoids. The name rhombic octahedron refers to the fact that 12 of the square faces lie in the same planes as the 12 faces of the rhombic dodecahedron, which is dual to the cube octahedron. Great rhombic octahedron is an alternative name for a truncated cube octahedron, whose faces are parallel to those of the rhombic octahedron. It can also be called an expanded cube or cantilated cube or a cantilated octahedron from truncation operations of the uniform polyhedron. Geometric relations there are distortions of the rhombic arboctahedron that, while some of the faces are not regular polygons, are still vertex uniform. Some of these can be made by taking a cube or octahedron and cutting off the edges, then trimming the corners. So the resulting polyhedron has 6 square and 12 rectangular faces. These have octahedral symmetry and form a continuous series between the cube and the octahedron. Analogous to the distortions of the rhombic osidodecahedron or the tetrahedral distortions of the cube octahedron. However, the rhombic octahedron also has a second set of distortions with six rectangular and sixteen trapezoidal faces, which do not have octahedral symmetry but rather th symmetry. So they are invariant under the same rotations as the tetrahedron but different reflections. The lines along which a Rubik's cube can be turned are projected onto a sphere, similar, topologically identical, to a rhombic octahedron's edges. In fact, variants using the Rubik's cube mechanism have been produced which closely resemble the rhombic arboctahedron. The rhombic arboctahedron is used in three uniform space-filling tessellations. The cantilated cubic honeycomb, the runcite truncated cubic honeycomb, and the runcinated alternated cubic honeycomb. Dissection The rhombic arboctahedron dissected into two square cupola and a central octagonal prism. A rotation of one cupola creates the pseudorhombic arboctahedron. Both of these polyhedra have the same vertex figure. 3.4.4.4 there are three pairs of parallel planes that each intersect the rhombic arboctahedron in a regular octagon. The rhombic arboctahedron may be divided along any of these to obtain an octagonal prism with regular faces and two additional polyhedra called square cupola, which count among the Johnson solids. It is thus an elongated square orthobicupola. These pieces can be reassembled to give a new solid called the elongated square gyrobicupola or pseudorhombic arboctahedron, with the symmetry of a square antiprism. In this the vertices are all locally the same as those of a rhombic arboctahedron, with one triangle and three squares meeting at each, but are not all identical with respect to the entire polyhedron, since some are closer to the symmetry axis than others. Orthogonal projections The rhombic arboctahedron has six special orthogonal projections, centered on a vertex, on two types of edges, and three types of faces, triangles, and two squares. The last two correspond to the B2 and A2 coxeter planes. Spherical tiling the rhombic arboctahedron can also be represented as a spherical tiling, and projected onto the plane via a stereographic projection. This projection is conformal, preserving angles but not areas or lengths. Straight lines on the sphere are projected as circular arcs on the plane. Pyrithohedral symmetry a half-symmetry form of the rhombic arboctahedron exists with pyrithohedral symmetry. 4, 3 plus, as coxeter diagram, Schlafler symbol S2, 3, 4, and can be called a cantic snub octahedron. This form can be visualized by alternatingly coloring the edges of the six squares. These squares can then be distorted into rectangles, while the eight triangles remain equilateral. The twelve diagonal square faces will become isosceles trapezoids.
In the limit, the rectangles can be reduced to edges, and the trapezoids become triangles, and a icosahedron is formed. By a snub octahedron construction, S3, 4, the compound of two icosahedra is constructed from both alternated positions. Algebraic properties. Cartesian coordinates Cartesian coordinates for the vertices of a rhombic octahedron centered at the origin, with edge length 2 units, are all permutations of if the original rhombic octahedron has unit edge length. Its dual strombic icosatetrahedron has edge lengths and area and volume the area A and the volume 5 of the rhombic octahedron of edge length are a Closed packing density The optimal packing fraction of rhombic octahedra is given by. It was noticed that this optimal value is obtained in a Bravais lattice by de Graaff. Since the rhombic octahedron is contained in a rhombic dodecahedron whose inscribed sphere is identical to its own inscribed sphere, the value of the optimal packing fraction is a corollary of the Kepler conjecture. It can be achieved by putting a rhombic octahedron in each cell of the rhombic dodecahedral honeycomb, and it cannot be surpassed since otherwise the optimal packing density of spheres could be surpassed by putting a sphere in each rhombic octahedron of the hypothetical packing, which surpasses it. In the arts, the large polyhedron in the 1495 portrait of Luca Pacioli, traditionally though controversially attributed to Jacopoda Barberi, is a glass rhombic octahedron half filled with water. The first printed version of the rhombic octahedron was by Leonardo da Vinci and appeared in his 1509 Divina Proportiona, a spherical 180 times 360 degrees panorama can be projected onto any polyhedron, but the rhombic octahedron provides a good enough approximation of a sphere, while being easy to build. This type of projection, called philosphere, is possible from some panorama assembly software. It consists of two images that are printed separately and cut with scissors while leaving some flaps for assembly with glue. Games and Toys The Freescape games Driller and Darkseid both had a game map in the form of a rhombic octahedron. The Hurry Scurry Galaxy in the video game Super Mario Galaxy has a planet in the similar shape of a rhombic octahedron. Sonic the Hedgehog 3 SI Scap Zone features pillars topped with rhombic arb octahedra. During the Rubik's Cube craze of the 1980s, one twisty puzzle sold had the form of a rhombic octahedron. The Rubik's snake toy was usually sold in the shape of a stretched rhombic octahedron. One model of Kabila's self-healing ground bouncing reactive targets styled a sphere resembles the rhombic arb octahedron. Related polyhedra The rhombic arb octahedron is one of a family of uniform polyhedra related to the cube and regular octahedron. Symmetry mutations This polyhedron is topologically related as a part of sequence of cantillated polyhedra with vertex figure, and continues as tilings of the hyperbolic plane. These vertex transitive figures have reflectional symmetry. Vertex arrangement It shares its vertex arrangement with three non-convex uniform polyhedra. The stellated truncated hexahedron, the small rhombi hexahedron, and the small cubic octahedron. Rhombic octahedral graph. In the mathematical field of graph theory, a rhombic octahedral graph is the graph of vertices and edges of the rhombic arb octahedron, one of the Archimedean solids. It has 24 vertices and 48 edges, and is a quartic graph Archimedean graph.